Now, Warak ibn Naufa is referring to Isa ibn Maryam, who is clearly a different character to By the historical way, Jesus. When you finish, because I need because I need to comment, because what you said, yeah, what you said is nonsense. Why? I will tell you why. Because actually it's the other way around. If you are using our sources about Warak ibn Naufa, let's use what is our sources saying about Warak ibn Naufa. Okay. You understand? You are, you are assuming things in our sources and you say, Firstly, you will never know about Warak ibn Nawfal if, if it wasn't introduced from Muslim sources, yes? So if we didn't have this in our sources, you will not use him, yeah? You will you don't know, have no clue about him. I'm not disregarding this. Okay, my, okay, so the source is telling us about the characteristics of Warak ibn Nawfal. Yes. Warak ibn Nawfal was well read, and then they said, that some, some by the way, they said was, was a, a Nazarene, was one of those monotheistic Christian, and some they said he was someone who was well read. In terms of the scripture. Now, what our sources. 